Playdates with Kate. Hi, welcome to Playdates with Kate. Our theme today is dinosaurs. Dinosaurs are so cool and awesome to learn about. You can call dinosaurs dinos for short. Dinosaurs lived on the earth millions of years ago. They no longer exist, which means they are extinct. There were many different types of dinos when they roamed the earth. Some of the dinosaurs ate meat. Those dinosaurs were called carnivores. Some of the dinosaurs ate plants. Those dinosaurs are called herbivores. Some of the dinosaurs ate both meat and plants. Those dinosaurs are called omnivores. I'm an omnivore because I eat both meat and plants like an omnivore dinosaur. Let's roar right now together, just like a dinosaur. First, let's roar quietly. Roar, roar, roar. Now let's roar loudly. Roar, roar, roar. Let's do it again softly. Roar, and again loudly. Roar. <laughs> That was awesome, great job. Look at my new dinosaur toy. Yeah, it's a dinosaur toy that is colored green and white. I can open up the dinosaur's mouth, watch. Chomp, 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 chomp. Inside I can see the dinosaur's teeth. They're so pointy. <laughs> this toy is fun. We can open up the dinosaur's back and look what's inside. What are these? What are these? Yeah, they're spikes that go on the dinosaur's back. Let's take them all out, out, taking them out. We got them all out. What colors do we have? We have blue spikes green spikes, orange spikes, and yellow spikes. The spikes need to go in here. This is the dinosaur's back. Do you see all those holes? Yeah. I'm gonna put it back on the dinosaur and click it in. Click. Now I can take these spikes and put them in the dinosaur's back. Put them in, in. Wow, this is so much fun. I can put the colors wherever I want to. In, in, watch this. If I put this one in the front, the dinosaur's mouth's gonna open up. In, whoa. And if I take it out, the dinosaur's mouth closes again. Open, close, open, close. Let's put the rest of the spikes in now. Put them all in. We did it! His back's covered in spikes. Let's count the spikes together. There's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. 11, 12, 12 spikes. Wow. Let's take him out now and put him back in the dinosaur to clean up. Cleaning up is fun. Taking them out, all out, all out of the dinosaur. There are no more spikes on the dinosaur's back, just holes. I'm gonna open up his back open. It's kind of tricky. There we go. I'm going to put them back in. Clean up. Clean up for another time. In, in, in. I'm going to put the dinosaur's back back on. We did it. We cleaned up. I loved playing with this toy together. It was so much fun. Dinosaur, dinosaur, turn around. Dinosaur, dinosaur, stomp the ground. 
Dinosaur, dinosaur, show your claws. Dinosaur, dinosaur, snap your jaws. Dinosaur, dinosaur, turn around. Dinosaur, dinosaur, point down. Let's do that again. Dinosaur, dinosaur, turn around. Dinosaur, dinosaur, stomp the ground. Dinosaur, dinosaur, show your claws. Dinosaur, dinosaur, snap your jaws. Dinosaur, dinosaur, turn around. Dinosaur, dinosaur, point down. Yay! A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J, K, L, M, N, O, P, Q, R, S, T, U, V, W, X, Y, and Z. Now I know my ABCs. Next time, won't you sing with me? A, B, C, Y and Z. Now we know our ABCs. Thank you for singing with me. We did a great job singing our ABCs together. That was so much fun. Yay! I have a book for us to read. This book is called How Did Dinosaurs Say Goodnight? by Jane Yolen and Mark Teague. Look at the cover of this book. There is a big T-Rex dinosaur, and it looks like he's sitting on a bed. Let's read this book and find out what's inside. How Did Dinosaurs Say Goodnight? by Jane Yolen and Mark Teague. Look at all the different types of dinosaurs. That dinosaur is sleepy. How does a dinosaur say goodnight when Papa comes in to turn off the light? That's a Tyrannosaurus Rex. He's playing with a choo-choo train. Does a dinosaur slam his tail and pout? The Stegosaurus is pouting. Does he throw his teddy bear all about? It's a Pteranodon. He's flying and throwing his teddy bear. Does a dinosaur stomp his feet on the floor and shout, I want to hear one book more? That's a Trachodon dinosaur. He's holding a book. Does a dinosaur roar? That's a Triceratops. He's roaring. And the dad is covering his ears because it's so loud. How does a dinosaur say goodnight when mama comes in to turn off the light? Does he swing his neck from side to side? That's an Apatosaurus. They have long necks. Does he up and demand a piggyback ride? That's an Ankylosaurus. That's the mama. She's surprised. Does he mope? Does he moan? Does he sulk? Does he sigh? The Allosaurus does not want to go to bed. Does he fall on the top of his covers and cry? That's a Corythosaurus dinosaur. He's crying. No, dinosaurs don't. They don't even try. They give a big kiss. Mwah. They turn out the light. Click, the Stegosaurus turned out the light with his tail. They tuck in their tails. They whisper, good night. That's a Demetrodon. He's saying goodnight to his mama. They give a big hug, then give one kiss more. Good night. Good night, little dinosaur. Look on this page. There are all the dinosaurs we saw in our book. There's an Allosaurus, a Corythosaurus, a Pteranodon, an Apatosaurus, a Demetrodon, an Ankylosaurus, a Trachodon, 
the Tyrannosaurus rex, or T-Rex for short, the Stegosaurus, and the Triceratops. Wow, that's a lot of dinosaurs. The end. Can you get out your two little hands? Great, we're gonna sing Open Shut Them. Open Shut Them, Open Shut Them. Give a little clap, clap, clap. Open Shut Them, Open Shut Them. Put them in your lap, lap, lap. Creep them, creep them, creep them, creep them. Right up to your chin, chin, chin. Open wide your little mouth, but do not let them in. Now we're gonna sing it again, but even faster. Can you sing it fast with me? Great, here we go. Open, shut them, open, shut them. Give a little clap, clap. Open, shut them, open, shut them. Put them in your lap, lap, lap. Creep them, creep them, creep them, creep them. Right up to your chin, chin, chin. Open wide your little mouth, but do not let them in. Great job, yay! Do your ears hang low? Do they wobble to and fro? Can you tie them in a knot? Can you tie them in a bow? Can you throw them over your shoulder like a continental soldier? Do your ears hang low? Do your ears stand high? Do they reach up to the sky? Do they droop when they are wet? Do they stiffen when they dry? Can you summon over your neighbor with a minimum of labor? Do your ears stand high? Do your ears flip flop? them as a mop. Are they stringy at the bottom? Are they curly at the top? Can you use them for a swatter? Can you use them as a blotter? Do your ears flip flop? Do your ears stick out as you waggle them about? Can you flop them up and down as you fly around the town? Can you shut them up for sure when you hear an awful bore? Do your ears stick do your ears give snacks? Are they filled up with wax? Do you eat it in the morning? Do you eat it in the bath? Do you eat it with the scone or do you eat it on its own? Do your ears give snacks? Do your ears hang low? Do they wobble to and fro? Can you tie them in a knot? Can you tie them in a bow? Can you throw them over your shoulder like a continental soldier? Do your ears hang low? Spinosaurus puzzle. Yeah, this Spinosaurus dinosaur puzzle, but it's missing its pieces. Will you help me put this puzzle back together? Great! Let's start with the head of the dinosaur. Our puzzle and dinosaur needs a head. I think I have the piece for it. Let's see if it fits. It does! This dinosaur is the color purple. It's a purple Spinosaurus dinosaur. Let's do some feet next. Hmm, I have a pair of two legs with feet. Do they fit here? No, it doesn't fit there. It fits right here. We have two of the dinosaur's legs. Now let's grab the dinosaur's body. Hmm, let's see which piece. Right here. Great job, that looks awesome. I have this piece too, which is the spine of the Spinosaurus. I'm gonna put it in. Yay! Now we just need to add the last two legs and the dinosaur's tail. Let's see. 
here's the tail of the dinosaur. I'm gonna put it together. And then the last two pieces, right there. And right there. Wow, look at our Spinosaurus dinosaur. It has a humpy back and it's the color purple. And if we look in the background, there's a volcano erupting, whoa! And there's a cute little pink flower. <laughs> museums are fun places to go to learn about different things. At museums, there are a lot of cool things to look at and to read. Let's go to a dinosaur museum right now together. Come on, let's go! Mara, are you excited to go to the dinosaur museum? Yeah, it's going to be so much fun. We're going to see so many different kinds of dinosaurs. Yeah. Yeah. Look, Mara, it's a paleontologist. He's digging up dinosaur bones. Whoa. That's so cool, huh? There are some more paleontologists. They're digging in the dirt. And that guy over there, what's he doing? He's looking at the ground, huh? And that guy back there, he's using a paper and pencil. Yeah. This big guy is a Torvosaurus. Wow, he's got a pretty long tail. He lived on Earth 150 million years ago. You're a dinosaur, Mara. Can you roar like a dinosaur? Roar! Roar! What did the dinosaur say? Mara, are you digging for bones? You're digging for bones, huh? And we can use these brushes to wipe away the sand and see the fossil. is on my head. <laughs> Silly Kate, this is a ball. Yeah, it's a fun ball toy and it's so colorful. Let's name all the colors together. There's the color orange. I also see the colors yellow, green, pink, and blue. This ball toy is pretty cool because it can open and close. Open and close. Can you say that? Great, say it with me. Open, close. We can also say out, in, out, in, out, in. Can you say that with me? All right, out and in. <laughs> Great job. Since it's kind of like a ball, 
We can throw this toy up and down, up and down, and we catch it in our hands. We can also throw the ball from side to side and catch it. Catch, catch, catch. Yay! This is a fun toy. And it can go big and small, big and small. <laughs> Yay! Five little monkeys jumping on the bed. One fell off and bumped his head. Mama called the doctor and the doctor said, no more monkeys jumping on the bed. Four little monkeys jumping on the bed. One fell off and bumped her head. Mama called the doctor and the doctor said, no more monkeys jumping on the bed. Three little monkeys jumping on the bed. One fell off and bumped his head. Mama called the doctor and the doctor said, no more monkeys jumping on the bed. Two little monkeys jumping on the bed. One fell off and bumped his head. Mama called the doctor and the doctor said, no more monkeys jumping on the bed. One little monkey jumping on the bed. She fell off and bumped her head. Mama called the doctor and the doctor said, no more monkeys jumping on the bed. No little monkeys jumping on the bed cause they were all stuck in bed. Hi everybody. We're gonna do a craft together. We're gonna make some dinosaur tracks. I have some green paper that looks like grass and I have some brown paint that I poured onto my paint plate. The brown paint looks like mud. I have my three dinosaur friends. We're gonna dip their feet into the brown paint and they're gonna make tracks on our green paper. Let's start with our long necked dinosaur. This dinosaur has a blue skin color and some black spots. Let's dip his feet into the brown paint. Dip, 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 dip. Now he can walk around. Walking around, stomp, stomp, stomp. Stomp, 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 stomp. Wow, look at that. He made so many dinosaur tracks with his feet. Let's take the next dinosaur. This dinosaur has a spiky back and a tail with three bumps. Let's dip his feet into the brown paint. Oh, he's getting all muddy. All muddy. How we can have him walk on the grass. Stomping, walking around. He might even roar, roar. Walking around. He's gonna go say hi to his other dinosaur friend. Hello, hello friend. Now we can take our last dinosaur. This dinosaur has a brown back and a green body. Let's dip him into the paint which we're gonna pretend is mud and get his feet all muddy, all muddy. Oh man, he's getting so dirty, so dirty. All right, he's gonna walk around, stomp, 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 stomp. He wants to get more dirty. Let's take some of our paint and squeeze it onto our paint plate. Now he can dip his feet in the mud again. Dip, 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 and walk around. Stomp, 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 walk, walk, walk. Ah, oh, he found his other two dinosaur friends. Wow, look at the tracks that they made. It kind of looks beautiful. Yeah, now they're all dirty. They needed to go get washed up. I have this yellow cup full of water that they can use to get clean. I don't want to take a bath. Sometimes we don't want to take baths. Just like this dinosaur, he doesn't want to take a bath. But 
Taking a bath feels so good and we get all clean. Let's dip him in. Yay, the bath is kind of fun. It is kind of fun, yeah. So much fun. Once we've dipped him in, we can wipe him off with a paper towel. Just tear a piece off and wash off his little dinosaur feet. Little dinosaur feet. He might need to dip them again because he's so dirty. He loves playing in the mud. Playing in the mud is fun. But after we get dirty, we need to clean up. All clean. Yay, all clean. Now we need to clean our other two dinosaur friends. Let's take Mr. Longneck Dinosaur and dip his feet into the water cup. Dip, dip, dip. Now we can wipe off his dinosaur feet. Wipe off his dinosaur feet. Wow, good job. He's being so well behaved. Good job, dinosaur. All right, our spiky dinosaur now needs to get clean. He loves the bath. Taking baths are so much fun. Dip, 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 dip in his feet. Now we need to wash it off and dry it with our paper towel. Dry, 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 dry. All clean! All three of our dinosaur friends are all clean! Now they can go walk around somewhere that isn't muddy. This was such a fun craft. You can do it at home. All you need is paper, some play dinosaurs, a paint plate, and some brown paint. It's also nice to have some water to wash your dinosaurs off. What are they doing? Roar! Oh, that's his tail. Roar! What does a dinosaur say? Roar! Roar. <gasps> What's that one? What color is it? It's green. Huh. Roar! 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 How many do you have? Good job, three dinosaurs. I have something so cool. I have this whole roll full of dinosaur stickers. There's a Spinosaurus, a Triceratops. Wow, there's so many dinosaurs on here. I'm gonna put some on my shirt. Let's see, I'm gonna take this Spinosaurus and put it right here. Do you see my Spinosaurus sticker? Yeah. There's a picture of a red dinosaur right here. I'm gonna put the sticker right here. Two stickers. I have two stickers, two stickers. Let's see, here's a blue dinosaur with a long neck and it's holding an egg. Yeah, it's holding a big white egg. I'm gonna add that to my shirt. That makes three stickers. Let's see what else we have. Hmm, here's a dinosaur with a spiky back. It's also the color red. I'm gonna add it to my shirt. Let's see, hmm. We don't have a Triceratops yet. Let's add a Triceratops. This Triceratops sticker is the color gray. Yeah, the Triceratops is the color gray. I'm gonna add it to my shirt. Wow, that makes five stickers. That's so many. That's a lot of stickers. I'm gonna do one more and I'm gonna put this sticker on my nose. <laughs> Let's see, which one do I wanna do? I'm gonna do this green dinosaur. This green dinosaur and put it on my nose. <laughs> That's so silly. It's on my nose. Where else can I put this sticker? I could put it on my chin. Yeah, I can put the sticker on my chin. Or I can put the sticker on my mouth, on my lips. <laughs> I can also put it on my ear. It's on my ear. I 
can put it on my forehead, my forehead. I can put it on my cheek. Yeah, my cheek. <laughs> That's so silly. I can put it so many different places on my face. I'm gonna put it finally on my shirt. Let's count how many stickers total I have on my shirt. One, two, three, four, five, six. Six dinosaur stickers, wow! There was a farmer had a dog and Bingo was his name. Oh, B-I-N-G-O, 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 and Bingo was his name. There was a farmer had a dog and Bingo was his name. Oh, Again. Goodbye, everybody. I had such a fun time today. We learned all about dinosaurs and we played games and sang songs. We even went to a dinosaur museum. It was so cool and awesome. I'll see you next time. Bye bye.